Hey, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video. In this video, I'll show you one of my passive income streams. That's in my opinion, one of the best options out there. If you're a, a long-term investor and just want to generate a passive income against your crypto tokens or savings slash fight at little to no risk. The way I generate a passive income on my crypto and fight is through a lending and a borrowing platform like Celsius Network. Celsius is just a centralized lending solution that's based on the blockchain technology where people borrow from Celsius or leave their crypto tokens on deposit with Celsius to be lent out. And in exchange for that, you earn some interest. I'll use these guidelines bullets for today's videos. Without further ado, let's get into it. We're all familiar with the traditional bank business model where you deposit your hard earned money in your insert bank name here. And however low today's interest rate may be, you're expecting to earn some interest payout on it. Then the bank uses your money to lend it out to borrowers. Usually the bank pays you anywhere from 0.05% to like 2%. This exact same bank structure of value creation is very similar to the Celsius network model where Celsius uses the crypto tokens or stable coins transferred by you, the user, for yield generating activities mainly through lending them out. And this allows Celsius to create a value and earn a return, which Celsius uses that to finance their operation like the Celsius network also to finance the weekly rewards that go to you. We're on the Celsius earn rates page where they show the coins that they accept and their interest rate. You could see here that for stable coins, you earn 8.8% APY and for cryptocurrencies, you earn 6.2% up to one Bitcoin and 3.5% after one Bitcoin. Ethereum is 5.35% up to a hundred Ethereum and then 5.05% after 100 Ethereum. You have many tokens available that you can start earning on them as soon as you deposit those tokens into Celsius. Celsius allows you to earn interest in two ways. The first way is in kind. So for example, if you deposit Bitcoin, your weekly earnings will be in Bitcoin. The second way is in Celsius native token, which is named Cell. Celsius gives you a higher interest rate on your token if you choose to earn your rewards and sell. And so for example, Ethereum, you earn 5.35% APY if you decide to earn it in kind, as in Ethereum. But if you choose to earn it and sell the native Celsius token, you earn 6.35%. And you could check for international rates and you could see how much more to earn it in Celsius. Unfortunately, the option to earn and sell is only available for international residents. It's not available for United States. If you're living in the United States, you only have one option, which is to earn in-kind rewards rates, which are still great compared to your bank. Celsius gives you 8.88% APY on your stable coins. A stable coin has a one-to-one -one ratio to the US dollar. If you have one USDC, this equals to $1. So if you have 1,000 USDC tokens, this equals to $1,000. So most stable coins are on a one-to-one -one ratio with the US dollar. Keeping some of your fight in a stable coin token on the side is a good way to stay ready to buy crypto tokens when the market is bearish. Most crypto traders stay in stable coins in a bearish market to buy the dip or to avoid crypto tokens market volatility. You can deposit any stable coin from your wallet to the Celsius network. I'll show you an example of this at the end of the video. So be sure to stick around to the end so you can follow along. If you are a US resident, you can earn these rates on the Celsius network and for stable coins, 8.88%. It's worth noting there is a difference between APY and APR. 
APY annual percentage yield, which takes in effect that you earn on your crypto, whereas APR annual percentage rate is the rate of interest paid or earned without the effect of compound interest. To find what's your APR, if it's not available, this is a calculator to convert APY to APR. And I'll put the link in the description so you can test it yourself. For a 8.88% APY on a stable coin, your APR will be 8.53. Your weekly earnings will be in APR. So 8.53 divided by 52 weeks in a year, your weekly reward will be 0.163% or 0.65% a month. So if you save your weekly rewards and compound it, the total will be 8.88% APY. You can apply this calculation for the other tokens to figure out your weekly rewards. When you start earning your rewards, your rewards are calculated every Friday and they're distributed every Monday to your account. So this means if you transfer your tokens in the middle of the week, you're only going to be rewarded for the days left in the week until Friday. Your first week will most likely be a little lower than the following weeks. Every Friday, a snapshot is taken of your balance and that's how they determine your weekly reward. And the payment goes to your account. I use Celsius for their stable coin, 8.88%. I won't get that anywhere else except DeFi. Speaking of DeFi, if you're familiar with DeFi or DEX in yield farms with their huge 100% plus APY, I'll talk more about DeFi and potential early DeFi projects in the upcoming videos. You might say, hey, CFT, these rates are trash compared to yield farms rates. I'll say to you this, yes, that's true. Yield farms bring incredible returns, but we all know yield farming comes with lots of risks. For example, impermanent loss, price fluctuation, early farmers dumping on you. I have more videos coming up on impermanent loss and DeFi risk, but Celsius is not like DeFi projects. Therefore, the returns offered by Celsius as a lending and a borrowing platform are still great. And Celsius has been consistent with their APY compared to similar lending and borrowing platforms like BlockFi or Voyage, which they're constantly changing their interest rates based on the market condition. This is one of the reasons why I chose Celsius. Here's some more pros offered by Celsius. There is no minimum deposit compared to like similar lending and borrowing platforms out there. Celsius doesn't charge any fees for their services. There are no withdrawal fees. There are no transfer fees. There are no transaction fees and no early termination fees. It's completely free to use Celsius. Now, you still need to consider the fees when you're sending your crypto from your exchange to Celsius. Here's a tip. Gemini, in my opinion, is the best one to use because they give you 10 free withdrawals a month with no fees. The Gemini withdrawal fees uh, schedule, if you do less than 10 withdrawals per month, these are the fees you could see for the Gemini dollar stable coin. It's free withdrawals. It's less than 10 times or equal. And if it's more than 10 times a month, it's still free withdrawals. So you're not paying any withdrawal fees to move your Gemini dollar from Gemini to any other exchange or wallet at a total of zero fees. To transfer your coins to your Celsius account, inside the Celsius app, click on the Celsius logo and you click on the transfer button. Choose the token that you want to deposit into Celsius and then it will generate an address for you. If you choose Bitcoin, for example, it will generate a Bitcoin address. You copy that address into the withdrawal field of your sending account or exchange. And it's always a good idea to send a small test transaction first. And then once you receive the small test transaction, you send the remaining coins after you confirm. Celsius is available on the Google Store for Android users. It has over 100,000 plus installations on Android. They also have an app for iPhones on the iOS. They also have 
a web app interface if you don't like to access your assets on smartphones. Please note that Celsius is very app based even though they have a web app interface, but you can only access it after you've passed the Know Your Client KYC on the app first. You need to first through the app and then you can log in into the web app. Celsius has 38 coins on their platform. They have flexibility on the coins that you want to start earning rewards on. Also, Celsius has plans for adding more coins in the future, like Cardano, Pocket, Perf, Dow. These coins are all top DeFi coins, which I'm guessing since each of these coins have billions of volume on their blockchain, it makes sense that they will offer more interest rate on these coins because of their volume. In the DeFi space, Celsius has their loyalty program, which allows you to earn more rewards based on how much sell token holdings you have. This would be great if it was available for US residents, but currently not available. What some users on the Celsius network are doing, they're buying sell off of FTX exchange. If you live in the US, FTX has banned the US. The only way to create an FTX account is through a VPN and I've created a video on what VPN I personally use to access FTX. There are two types of FTX. There is the international FTX and there is the US FTX for US customers. The only problem is sell is not available on the FTX US. It's only available on the international FTX and the only way you can use the international FTX is through a VPN if you live in the US. So check out that video if you like. I go through everything step by step. Another feature on Celsius is what's called cell pay in the app, which allows you to choose any user on the Celsius network that you would like to send crypto. It's as easy as select the coin and the amount. Obviously put the wallet of that user and send it. It's that easy. Unfortunately, they say that cell pay might not be available in your country state due to local laws and regulations. It's not a big deal for me. If you want to send money to another user, you can just send it to their external wallet address and they, they could send it themselves from their wallet into their Celsius wallet. Another thing that I really like about Celsius is the promo codes. They have promo codes that you can enter in the app in your account to earn some free money, basically free money on top of your weekly earnings. Check out my Celsius promo code in the description. You'll earn $40 and I'll earn $40 as well when you sign up for a Celsius account. Now, the big question you might have is, is Celsius safe? Celsius, they started in 2017. So they've been around since 2017. They have 15 billion in community assets with 8.2 billion in loans processed so far. These are like huge numbers with almost 1 million community members and they have an office in New Jersey as well. If they're complying with all the U.S. regulations, that means they're not cutting any corners. They're abiding by all the regulations. And we all know how strict the crypto regulations are in New York and New Jersey. They also have legit support channels, one through their Celsius support page where they have tons of articles and FAQs. Their Twitter, social media support, they're pretty active on it. Also, they have support on their Reddit page. Another thing is their Celsius security. They tell you how to keep your uh, Celsius account safe and secure. They give you the option where you have a two-factor authentication on the mobile app. You can whitelist your crypto withdrawal addresses within the app. They have what's called a huddle mode. If you have the huddle mode on, you won't be able to make any withdrawals. You could do deposits, but you can't take out any tokens without entering the, the huddle code that they generate once you activate the mode. And 
it takes 24 hours with the code to disable Blahara mode. Use non-SMS based two-factor authentication. Instead of using SMS two-factor authentication, you want to use Google Authentication or Authy. Make sure you have a unique email address. They have the cybersecurity framework where they talk about governance management. They do penetration testing and vulnerability assessment of their network. Again, multi-factor authentication, access controls, why trust Celsius with their 15 billion of community assets and 300 million of earnings paid out in the last 12 months. They were also featured in high communities. This is the CEO interviewed at NASDAQ. And most importantly, they are in compliance with security regulation. Unfortunately, are not FDIC or SIPC insured. There's certainly a risk whenever you're depositing any cryptocurrency with Celsius, but all the measurements taken to secure your assets, the fact that they're in compliance with the U.S. Securities and Exchange Committee, that speaks volume in my book. One thing worth noting, opt-in insurance, you could access this through the app where you can opt in in a self-insurance wait list where some of the rewards will go into this insurance. That's still in development. They're testing the water with it and they're doing this uh, survey on the app. You can also download your 1099 IRS, go into your profile in the app and you'll see the report section where it will say tax or report from whichever year. Another huge plus about Celsius is Celsius borrow at 1% APR using your crypto as a collateral. What you do is you choose a stable coin and you enter the amount that you want to borrow and you pick the collateral out of your balance and the interest rate and you select the length of the loan. You can extend it or close it at any time so you can pay it off early before the length of the loan and you confirm the details and get approved. There is no credit check. It's not based on age, race. It's all based on your balance. So you can borrow in stable coin. Note that you will always put up more in collateral than the value of the loan. So if you want to loan $500, your collateral need to be 2000 Obviously, the longer the term is, the more interest you will pay. You can pay it off before the loan term. You could borrow $10,000 and your interest will be 695 in a year. A monthly interest of $57.92 that will be withdrawn out of your account. Here is an example of how I transfer my FIAT from Gemini to Celsius. I'll go to my Gemini account and I'll go to the Gemini dollar. You can see here one Gemini dollar is equal to one dollar. Let's say I have money in USD and I want to buy Gemini dollar. I'll just enter 1000. It's worth mentioning that you can earn 7.4% APY on Gemini dollar through the earn page. It's a little under 8.8% .8 that you get on Celsius and you also don't get free promo codes on Gemini like you do on Celsius. So currently I don't have anything in my balance, but you would select the balance over here. Click on the transfer withdrawal from Gemini. Choose the token GUSD, click continue. Yeah, I don't have balance in my GUSD right now, so it's not allowing me to go to the next step, but you're going to select the destination. Once you're inside the Celsius app, click on the logo at the bottom of the screen, click on receive, choose your token. We're going to choose Gemini dollar. Select it. This address is only for Gemini dollar. Send in other Gemini dollar tokens or other digital assets to this address may result in a permanent loss of funds. Click yes, copy this address and paste it. Then the money will be available inside your Gemini dollar account and it's going to show up here under the transaction history. 
and then you will receive your earning on the following Monday. Overall, the Celsius network is a great platform for beginners who want to start buying crypto without taking on the full risk that comes with this volatile market. And it's great for passive investors that are just looking for a safer way to buy and hold crypto. If you like this video, drop a like, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. I got more videos coming up like this about passive income and DeFi and technical analysis. Drop your questions and requests down below. I'll leave all the links shown in this video in the description below, and I'll see you all out. TFT signing out.